Supermax. Um, it shows an image of John Brown and Harriet Tubman leading a contemporary African-American man out through the woods away from a Supermax prison. Um, it's in the dead of night and there's a sense where we're really close up and in all of the, the, the big watercolors, I, I was trying to get this kind of dramatic sense of like, here's the, here's the foreground. It's really close up. And then we go and it goes all the way back. And so in this case, you have this incongruous, uh, anachronistic scene where the equivalent of the, of the enslaved who you're, who John Brown and, and Harriet Tubman led out of, out of bondage, uh, along the underground railroad, um, is still, they're still there. They're now they're in a supermax prison. And so in the back is the supermax prison, but in the middle ground is an old locomotive. And that old locomotive, while it is an obsolete technology as a, as a, um, as an idea of transportation, as a kind of metaphor in the American landscape, it's still very much there. It's very much there as a, as a, um, as an idea, even though we don't really take trains the way we used to. But the idea of a train that runs through the landscape, uh, either carrying goods or people or just cutting through the landscape. So that's what's at play there. Harry Tubman was uh, friends with John Brown and his and her nickname was the General. And so I wanted that sense of the two of them as partners working together.